Springer, Riley Herps leading them to the green flag in overtime here at Nashville Super Speedway. Green flag is out. Austin Hill pushing hard on the back bumper of A.J. Allmendinger. And now he goes to the middle, or he tries to go to the middle. It's not there. Riley Herbst on the top side of the racetrack. He made it work the last time. He'll try to do it again. But A.J. Allmendinger has the race lead off two. A.J. Allmendinger in the lead, down the back stretch. They are all over the place behind him, three wide in certain spots of the track. But A.J. Allmendinger is pulling away now. As he works his way off turn four, he'll come looking for the white flag. While everyone else was wrestling and jostling, A.J. Allmendinger drove a pretty wheel. He will lead them on the white flag lap by 15 car lengths. A.J. Allmendinger. Springer's lead continues to grow. Side by side, fight for second. Riley Herbst up top. To the bottom is Austin Hill. Everybody trying to position there for the second, for the runner-up finish, for the third finish, because there is no stopping A.J. Allmendinger. He rockets down the back stretch here at the Nashville Super Speedway. Midway through three and four, here comes A.J. A.J. Allmendinger has survived here late in the Tennessee Lottery 250. He'll win in overtime. A.J. Allmendinger, he'll take the checkered flag ahead of Riley Herbst and Sam Mayer. And now trouble across the start finish line. Going around once, twice, Parker Kligerman. And Kligerman's car does AJ, not get hit. It's also uh, Justin Allgaier is involved in this too. Kligerman oh. will finish 11th spinning across the racetrack. Allgaier is going to get credit at this point for 15th with his car up against the fence about 100 yards past the start finish line. Anthony Alfredo also chewed up in that mess, but we finally get to the end. It took 196 laps to wrap up the Tennessee Lottery 250.